Hi guys, so today we're doing my skincare routine. But this is only for school, so obviously it has changed quite a lot um, because I don't go to school anymore. So, um, yeah, I've only got a couple of products to show you. And I just want to say, excuse how greasy and horrible my hair looks. I'm having it cut today because um, I haven't had it cut in literally like ages. Um, so I'm, I'm having it washed, so I thought this I'm putting washing in it and then washing it again because that would do more damage than not washing it. So I'm going to say sorry about that. My hair care routine for school will be down below, or my hair care routine in general will be down below. And let's get started. Okay, so the first thing is this, and this is a deep pore treatment pad. And these are really good because they, um, they really open up your pores and get into them. So whatever you're gonna do after that, like if you're gonna wash it or you're gonna put a face mask on, it will really go right into your pores and really get rid of every single piece of gunk that's in there. Um, I would not recommend just doing this and then moisturizing because that, I don't think that's gonna actually cleanse them out. They're just opening the pores for you so that you can get something else in there to clean them. So I really love things for school because you know, you're out, you're about, you have like, it's all dirty and germs everywhere, basically. So, um, at the end of the day, I just like to do that and then put the next product on that I'm going to show you. So after I've done this, I like to go in with this, which is a 99.9, .9, it kills 99.9% .9 bacteria. And this is really good. This is like a family hand size wash, but I can use this in like a month. So this lasts me a month. And it's really good. It just like, especially if you use this, you can literally see all the gunk coming out, which is good um, of your pores because you don't want it to stay in your pores. So I normally do this like once a week, maybe at the end of the week on a Friday. And then I'd normally put on a peel off um, face mask, which has changed drastically because I don't even like them anymore. So I used to peel, do the peel off face mask while my pores were still open with, they were normally clean, but I would just double check there was nothing in there to peel everything out. Okay, so every day I used to use this, and this was a tea tree foaming hand wash. And this used to be so, so good. I'm gonna tell you where I got the, all this stuff from. This, I have no idea from my sister, she gave them to me, but I think they're like, I think they're somewhere from like Aldi or something like that. Um, she told me, I can't remember. Um, and this is from Aldi and it's like £2, so it's really good. This is from Poundland and it's £1. And normally in Boots, and the exact same thing, it's £4.99. So, whichever one you want to go and do, then go and get it. But um, this is really good just to freshen up, really. I find it to freshen up and it kind of controls your acne a bit better um, as you've been near dirt and everything all day. So, I really like this. Okay, so the next thing is this, and you, if you've been here for the whole time that I've started YouTube, you'd probably know that I love this stuff. Okay, so this is the original source mint and tea tree shower gel, but I use it for under the eye treatment, and you put it under your eyes and it tightens them, and um, it wakes you up in the morning. So I like to put this all over my eyes to tighten them. And since I haven't been doing this quite a lot, I've actually noticed that I've got started to get like mix of like under eye circles even though I haven't been doing this and this is one pound from Poundland so I would recommend this and when I don't do this either I get really dry eyes around here I don't know how well you can see like the little creases but that's because I haven't been doing this and this is a very very moisturizing treatment and I love it Okay, so the last thing I used to do when I walked out the door was put this on. I still always put this on. I normally just do this, these two now, but I always put this on. This is my DIY, I think I call it like face primer. It'll be linked down below. Um, so I've got like a couple of things linked down below. Um, but this is really good. It moisturizes your skin. It stays on all day long. You don't have to keep on replying it. I only like to reapply it because it feels so good on your skin. Um, it's got all the good stuff in it. It protects you from the sun. 
it's got really good healing ointments in it and I just really recommend this stuff because it is amazing. Link will be down below if you want to hear more about this. Okay guys, so that was my um, face care routine. I hope you guys enjoyed. The things that will be linked down below are my hair care routine, um, how to make this and my top five moisturizers so you know kind of what's in this and why I like it so much. And that's what's going to be linked down below, my Facebook, Twitter, and not my Facebook, my Twitter, my Snapchat, and my Instagram will be all be linked down below. Um, I might make a Facebook page soon, I don't know. Um, but yeah, excuse my hair, it'll be looking good and probably a hundred times better tomorrow because I'm having it cut, I'm having some like feathers in it, so yeah, it's going to look a lot more bouncier in the life, basically. And like this video if you like more kind of back to school face care routines and stuff like that comment some back to school ideas down below because that would be really a lot of help and subscribe if you want to see more so i'll see you guys later and yeah why don't i keep on messing up My hair looks ratchet. Because I'm ratchet. Okay, let's go. <laughs>